All right, boys and girls, I'm Firefighter John. We've met before, but one more thing that we're gonna go over here is uh, stop, drop, and roll. You might have heard of this before. If not, then uh, welcome, and uh, I'll teach you how to do that. You're gonna use stop, drop, and roll if you ever catch on fire, okay? Um, if any part of you is on fire, you're gonna go ahead and stop exactly what you're doing. Get down as quickly as you can, all right? And then all you're gonna do is exactly what we said. You're just gonna roll back and forth until you actually get out all the fire. You're basically patting it so it gets smothered. And then when you're done, go get help. Go tell a parent. Hi boys and girls, um, Firefighter John. Uh, what we're gonna be doing now is I'm gonna go ahead and show you what happens if you're sleeping in your bed at night and a fire alarm goes off, uh, what do you do? And before I do it, basically, you're gonna be asleep, you're gonna wake up, you're gonna stay calm, you're gonna to go to the ground, stay on all fours, that means crawl, okay? And then you're gonna to go to your exit. Mine's over to my right, um, but wherever that may be for you. You're gonna to go to your door, you're gonna feel it with the back of your hand, make sure it's not hot, and go ahead and go out if it's not hot. If it is hot, we're gonna stay inside, close our door, put some clothes underneath it so smoke can't get in, and we're gonna look for another way out. So we're gonna go through that right now. So. I'm gonna get comfy with uh, this guy right here. I'm gonna be asleep just like this. So you're gonna wake up, stay calm. That's a big one, all right? We're gonna take our time, get down to the floor, stay low. And the reason why we do that is because there's all that yucky smoke that you don't wanna breathe in. If you're staying low, the smoke always goes high. So you're, you'll be right underneath it in nice clean air. You're gonna crawl over to wherever you gotta go to get outside of your uh, your room. You're gonna feel with the back of your hand. Um, if it's hot, we're gonna go ahead and keep that door closed. We're gonna take some clothes that you have around your room and shove it underneath, okay, to prevent any sort of smoke from coming in. And we're gonna look for another way out or wait for someone to help us. Um, if, in this case, it's actually not hot, I'm gonna go ahead and open it look outside see if I see any fire and if I don't I'm gonna go ahead and start crawling out and going to my meetup place with my family and that's what we do